Hey, good morning. This is Chris Menard. Uh, this was a question I was asked on my YouTube channel. In Zoom, when you share a video and the video is playing, the host can hear the sound, but none of the participants could. So let me just, one video, one topic, let me show you how to hear the sound when you're sharing a video. So I have an Excel file pulled up. I have, sorry, I have an Excel video pulled up I did. Uh, simple interest versus compound. I want to share it in Zoom. So I'm going to quickly start my Zoom meeting. New meeting. Doesn't matter whether it's a scheduled meeting. I want to go to share. I want to share just that video, which is right here. And here's the trick. You must click on down here, share computer sound, or you'll only hear it as the host. The participants won't hear it. But let's test to see if this works. I'm going to hit share. So I'm now sharing my screen. I'm going to hit play. The future value function equals FV. There are five arguments. I'm the host and Three I'm hearing required, it. But I'm going to end up using if I pull in this up video. I'll end up using all five as at some a point. participant. The interest rate so is I have 10%. This and joining right now. In this example, I don't have I'm to do it, but I'm going to go ahead and make it official. I would divide that by the compounding frequency. Chris one is me so as if a participant. You, if it was compounded monthly, you would divide by 12. That would be the number 12 in cell B5. I'm on my phone and I hear it. Comma. So that's working. Mute. Sorry. NPER is the term. That is going to be B. Pause. <laughs> All right. So that is the trick. Just make sure when you share the video, you share the computer sound. Let me do that one more time. I'm going to stop share, find out what you're going to share, and share the computer sound. Uh, real quick tip, and I'm going to do this in another video about sharing in general. If you don't need to share your entire screen, don't, because that is the default. I don't know if you can tell here, I've got a 27-inch monitor. You can't tell from there, but I've got a really large monitor. If I share my screen and people are on a 13-inch laptop screen or a 15-inch laptop screen, it may be difficult for them to see, especially if I'm sharing something like Excel or a really long Word document. So just share an application if that works, if you can get by with that. So I would share just this window. If I was sharing an Excel file, I would only share the Excel file if I had one running. Anyway, thank you. Uh, subscribe to my channel. Keep the questions coming. I rarely post two videos in one day, but I'm getting a lot of Microsoft team questions and I love Microsoft teams. That's what Christian and I use, um, to manage my website. We're coming up with a video tonight on Microsoft teams, sharing your screen in teams. Thank you. Have a good day.